they must protect me. The gods chose you as a king and not a fighter. Do not impute on the gods what they did not say. You have a bright future. And I do not want you to kill it with your pride. I am not being proud. I am just being concerned, my lady. I've told you to stop calling me your lady because I am not one. I like you as a friend and that's it. Yes. But our destinies are entwined from creation by the gods. You know what? It's been long I returned from Ndoki Kingdom. I should be on my way. Hey. Machi, thought you came to see me. I came to discourage you from fighting Azuka and bringing shame to the gods. Yes, despite your rejection, you still care. I will, you, I will give up by now. Beautiful maiden, permit me before I walk past to compliment the works that the gods have done in you. <sighs> You're a rare beauty. <laughs> <sighs> this morning sun will be very jealous at your smiles. Thank you. You are indeed an act of the gods. You look strong and handsome. Really? Well, um, my name is Emelobi from Amaba clan. What is your beautiful name? <laughs> Masinachi. But people call me Machi. I'm from Iluaka clan. I prefer Machi. Um, I must run now. Um, I must attend to this lady before dawn. I hope by the gods I get to see you again. If the gods will. Mm. Alright, my beautiful lady. It's again. Mm -hmm. Are you a warrior? Are you a warrior? You better concentrate on healing people and leave the warriors to fight for us. I know, but someone has to stand up and defend this land. I am persuaded that someone is me. Do you even hear yourself? What do you know about war? Do you think war is about a mix, missing different heads together? And in fact, you are not even going anywhere. Let's talk about something else. And do you want to stop me? Yes, I will stop you. <laughs> you cannot. Me, tomorrow evening. I'm going to see the others. You will stop going to the war. I will stop you. I am going to see the others tomorrow. You are going nowhere. You are not going anywhere. Oh, Emelobi. Oh, oh. No, listen. talk to him. Emelobi. Talk to him. Listen, Emelobi. I do not want to hear you again say you are going to fight anyone. But, Papa. Oh, stop it. I said stop it. You are not going anywhere. This is the type of mood I love to see anytime you come back from Akon. This happiness cannot come unless from the one the cause has chosen. Wow. And who has they chosen to be our king? 
The woman with the crest out of her breast shall the one who will rule this kingdom with a thousand years of peace and prosperity be born. Wise one, you and I know that this crest is not a symbol in our clan in this kingdom. Yes. Mba, mba, mba. Wise one. Um, wise one. How can you say that a stranger will produce us a king? Mm -hmm. eh? mm -hmm. How is it possible? How, how is it? You all speak as if you doubt the knowledge and wisdom of our gods. Wise one, how do you mean? How? Another child shall be born and she will have this symbol. Uh, uh, please, wise one, clarify us. We are getting confused. <laughs> the maiden with the symbol is the one that will make the chosen of the gods whole. Find her, keep her by his side, and the wish of the gods will be fulfilled. Wise one, if I tell you that I am not confused here, you know I'll be making a big fool of myself. I'm not the only confused person here. Please speak to us in the language that we we'll understand. Biko. The gods have spoken. And in due season. It will manifest. Wonderful, oh. Wonderful, <laughs> 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 That is <laughs> exactly what I want to ask you. Move. Okay. Do you believe in this Amuma prediction that a strange woman is going to be out an heir to the throne of this kingdom? I know, CK. You and I know that Amuma is the most faithful priest that has ever served the shrine of Igodawa. His vision and words are nothing than the minds of the gods. I know what this particular prediction is too hard to believe because no stranger has ever produced an heir to the throne of this kingdom. Despite that, the one that confuses me the most is uh, about the maiden he talked about. How are we going to find her? I mean, how, what, that is the question. How are we going to find her? Anosike, you and I know that the gods do things in their own ways. I suggest we keep an open mind while we wait for the gods to reveal their mind to us. That is my suggestion. I think you're right. Let's keep an open mind and be patient. Indeed, that is exactly what we should do.
my shot. Trust me. I don't miss. Look at that, she's dead. Let's go. Will she leave? Yes, she will leave. She was shot with a poison arrow. I've removed the poison. As you can see, I'm giving her some herbs. What is left now is our will and our chi. Please, do everything possible to revive her. I will try my best. The Christ has entered the land. Wise one, you already know? Yes. So, that woman will bear a child that will be our king in this kingdom. She is the mother of the king and he is the chosen one. When he is in difficulty, the gods will help him because he is theirs. And only then will the symbol appear. I've come to see her mama and he already knows she's here. How? I do not know. Okay. How did you find her? I found her at Iosusu. She's beautiful, you know. But the question is, will she leave? Of course, said she will leave. So let's be patient. So now, what exactly are you going to do with her? I think I will marry her as soon as she regains her strength. You see, if she's going to bear us a child that will later become a king in our kingdom, I think it will be befitting if 
a man of high status and prestige marries her from this kingdom. I totally agree with you. We must preserve legacy, you see. The throne of Umuizala kingdom does not belong to strangers, rather it belongs to us, sons of the soil. you where am i don't worry you, you are safe please have some rest where is this place umuizela kingdom the safest of all places to be yes yes have some rest please relax yourself Nene. oh Pico. But, but i'm fine i know boy. i know boy you need some rest please please Pico. have some rest lie down Blessed be to the big girl. Oh, oh. <laughs> blessed be to the gods who have graced us with this beautiful maiden. Mm. <laughs> what other one? No. Hey, uh, this one that I have not had uh, the cry of her mother. Chia, we are so sorry. She didn't make it. Huh? Hey! What? Why? Hey! Hey! We are so sorry. Hey! Why? Why? Because why? Oh, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Greetings, it is in one. Greetings, my own one. May the gods be with you. Greetings, maidens of women. <laughs> May the gods be with you. And also, also be with you. you. Look at him with all endowment of the gods. <laughs> Looking so strong and handsome. 
I wish I could be in his arms. Each day I see him, I wish he is my man. But the gods have deprived me of having him by giving him a bride. <coughs> <coughs> Why are you laughing? Am I not beautiful enough to be the queen of this kingdom? Oh, if you think you're beautiful enough to be the queen of this kingdom, what would you not say of me? Because I know I'm more beautiful than you. See who is more beautiful than me. Ah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Madam Beautiful. You're beautiful enough to be the queen. But that will be in your dreams. Bye bye. I'll have your time. It is no longer a secret that the people of Omonkama want to go to war with us over that portion of land because their demand is the same as war. So what is their demand? What else? They want our best warrior to fight their best warrior in a fight till death march or they will attack us a fight the death that has always been their way yeah the same old pattern i see no near gee but you them boy now all here sorry they know their advantage because of their greatest warrior azoka who has never lost a battle or a fight. That's why. <clears throat> My people. You babu wuna mwa ika wabari razu. Tipa mata na wadi ime. Honestly. I do not see a man. In this our kingdom. Capable of fighting Azoka. And if we do not give in to their request, they will attack us, which they have been looking forward to. I will fight him. Yes, I will fight Azoka. My beautiful daughter. Hey, you're welcome. Thank you. How was your journey? 
Have you gone mad? How can you volunteer to go and fight Azuka? You are the future king of this kingdom. But mother, you always tell me that I am the hope of the people. Now, in the moment of their hopelessness, why don't I step up and provide them the hope that they see me as? By committing suicide. Answer me, Akuna! By committing suicide! You are the future king, and I, Isoma, will not allow you to kill yourself! <laughs> I thank the gods that you know I'm your father and I'm going to give you fatherly advice. No need being stubborn here. You cannot fight Azoka. Mother will make a yeah, But father, I can Shh. I am done with this discussion. Mother, what you people are asking me to do is to cow in. I am, I'm, I am not a coward. I am not. There is nothing cowardly about this. You must survive to be king. And when you become king and acquire so much power, then you can fight the people of Omokamu for our lands that stole from us. But until then, she must leave. My daughter, the gods indeed bless you with wisdom. Yes, she is blessed with wisdom. F Father, it baffles me that you don't know the lion you give birth to. It baffles me. Papa, you're welcome. Thank you. Were you able to get the herbs? So, I didn't get anything, even a single herb. Our village warriors blocked the pathways to the farm. Why? Why would they block the ways? So, I heard that the people of Umunkama threatened war again against us. And very soon as I'm talking to you, that might strike. But blocking the ways, will this stop them from striking? So it will not stop them. Because they want to fight us. And you know they are warriors. We are not a match with them. We are not. Especially when Asoka is with them. Uh, Papa, this Umokama people, is there no way we can make a peace treaty with them? I mean, we don't need to go to war. Son, that is the wish of every reasonable man of this our land. That treaty won't work. They wouldn't agree. Why? All they want is war. All they want is war. You remember, this is your chief warrior. Azoka has never lost a battle. They need war. Son. Son. Papa. Please round up with what you are doing. Okay? Remember, you are going to see Neada at her place very soon, okay? What are you thinking, Akuna? 
Machi. I still don't know why everybody finds it difficult to believe that I can fight Azoka and save this kingdom from shame. See, the gods chose me to rule over these people and so they must protect me. The gods chose you as a king and not a fighter. Do not impute on the gods what I did not say. You have a bright future and I do not want you to kill it with your pride. I am not being proud. I am just being concerned, my lady. I've told you to stop calling me your lady because I am not one. I like you as a friend and that's it. Yes. But our destinies are entwined from creation by the gods. You know what? It's been long I returned from Ndoki Kingdom. I should be on my way. Hey, Machi. Thought you came to see me. I came to discourage you from fighting Azuka and bringing shame to the gods. Yes, despite your rejection, you still care. I will, you, I will give up by now. Beautiful maiden. Permit me before I walk past to compliment the works that the gods have done in you. <sighs> You're a rare beauty. <laughs> <sighs> this morning sun will be very jealous at your smiles. Thank you. You are indeed an act of a god. You look strong and handsome. Really? Well, um, my name is Emelobi from Amaba clan. What is your beautiful name? <laughs> Masinachi. But people call me Machi. I'm from Iluaka clan. I prefer Machi. Um, I must run now. Um, I must attend to this lady before dawn. I hope by the gods I get to see you again. If the gods will. Mm. Alright, my beautiful lady. Melody, it's again. Are you a warrior? Are you a warrior? You better concentrate on healing people and leave the warriors to fight for us. I know, but someone has to stand up and defend this land. I am persuaded that someone is me. Do you even hear yourself? What do you know about war? Do you think war is about a mix, missing different heads together? And in fact, you are not even going anywhere. Let's talk about something else. And do you want to stop me? Yes, I will stop you. <laughs> you cannot. <laughs> me, tomorrow evening. I'm going to see the others. You will stop going to the war. I will stop you. I am going to see the others tomorrow. You are going nowhere. You are not going anywhere. Oh, oh. Emelobi. Oh. oh. Listen. Papa, talk to him. Emelobi. Talk to him. Listen, Emelobi. I do not want to hear you again say you are going to fight anyone. But, Papa. Oh, stop it. I said stop it. You are not going anywhere. This is the type of mood 
I love to see any time you come back from Akon. This happiness cannot come unless from the one the gods has chosen or have gifted. Father, please stop talking about him and allow this bliss in my heart to last. Are you saying that all these mice are not as a, serious, uh, as a result of seeing Akona today? Father, please stop mentioning his name. Because of my father, please bring him back my way. I want to see his handsome face one more time. My elders, why would you listen to Akona's decision on going to fight Azuka? Don't you know why the people of Omo Kama are doing this? It's because we do not have a king who will form an ally with other kingdoms. And the only one, I mean, the only one the gods give us, you are sending him to his early death. Um, Isyama, we indeed cheer and not supporting Akuna to fight Azoka. Because we know it is suicidal. Yes. And we don't need to lose a man and as well lose the land. So, so just let's give them the land. Let's give them the land. And then what? Go back to dog eat dog. How many times in the past have they come and demanded for our land? Threatening us. And we the people of Umeziana will cowardly yield to their demands. I suggest my elders that we stand up this time and fight these people. You have spoken well. This is exactly what I have been expecting from the youth of this kingdom. This is a man. Yes. Hmm. Hmm. My son, it is true that a woman who is desperate to have a child goes to bed with only a rapper. But not in this case. This case is suicidal. And your speech just reminded me what my father told me in those days. That a child who has never seen the effect of war goes about asking for one. There will be no war. Huh? Mm -hmm. It has always been their pattern to ask us, the people of Umeziala, to bring a man to fight their man in a battle to death. I suggest that we give them a man to fight Azuka. Hmm. I will fight Azuka. Huh? Huh? Did you see that? Are you a magician? <laughs> <laughs> yes. No. My son, what is your name? My name is Emelobi, the son of Okomba, the healer from Amamba clan. Hmm. So, how many people have you killed in the past? None. None? <laughs> None? The rumor has it that this Azoka you are going to fight started killing when he was a child. And he has a total of 968 kills. And you, who has never lifted up a sword to kill, is going ah. to fight a man like that? There is nothing impossible for a just man whom the gods are with. Let me fight Azuka. And let the people of Umukama know that even a rat develops teeth to bite. Mm. Mm. Please wait. Wait. Um, 
I, I want to thank you for your act today. That's exactly what my people need. Well, I have already discussed that with the elders before now. To let me fight Azoka, but they won't let me. I guess they are scared. You don't need to fight Azoka. Oh. You are the future king and hope of the people. Help me put a word across to your father. Let him allow me to fight Azuka. Hmm. I want to fight Azuka. I will talk to my father on your behalf. You have my word. Um, <clears throat> once again, I appreciate your courage. Thank you so much. Thank you, my prince. May the gods be with you. That's exactly what my people need. Where are you coming from? I want you not to see the elders. Do you want to kill yourself? Papa, don't be afraid. I'm not going to die. The gods are with me. Yes, I know. The gods are with you. Yes, the gods are with all of us. But we have to preserve and protect our lives by ourselves for ourselves. I'm sorry, Papa. I've made up my mind to fight Azuka. Who is that young man that wants to waste his life? Mother. He is a nobody, but a concerned son of this kingdom. Allow him to fight Azoka and let the people of Omonkama know that we are not afraid of them. Letting him fight Azoka is sending him to his death. I am Ankama. I still insist. Allow him fight Azoka. He already knows that facing Azoka might cost his life. But he insists. Allow him. Nay. What do you think of that young man's decision to fight Azoka? Although he is asking for his death. But he is right. Yes. We need to let them know that we are capable of fighting them. Hmm. So I support my son. I don't like the idea. At all. I don't like it. We must not waste a man to show them that we are not afraid of them. You can't kill a man because of that. We can't. Mother, Emelobi has made up his mind to fight Azoka. Why stopping him? Let us allow him to do this for us. My daughter, you came back earlier than supposed. Father, who is this man that wants to fight Azoka of Umunkama Kingdom? He is a fool. A man who does not know the true test of Bitakola, not to speak of how war feels. What is his name and what clan is he from? Um, he called himself Emilobi. From my mother, Clem.
beautiful lady. Permit me before I walk past to compliment the works that the gods have done in you. <sighs> You're a rare beauty. <sighs> this morning sun will be very jealous at your smiles. Thank you. You are indeed an act of the gods. You look strong and handsome. Really? Well, um, my name is Emelobi from Amaba clan. What is your beautiful name? <laughs> Masinachi. But people call me Machi. I'm from Iluaka clan. I prefer Machi. Um, I must run now. Um, I must attend to this lady before dawn. I hope by the gods I get to see you again. If the gods will. Mm. Alright, my beautiful lady. Are you alright? My daughter, what is wrong? Nothing. Are you alright? Yes, yes. Is it? Since last night, you, you have not been yourself. Father, you are awake. How was your night? I hope the gods were with you all through the night. My night was not all that good. Because something is bothering my beautiful daughter. What is it? Father, I'm fine. Nothing is wrong with me. No. I you know it. You are lying to your father. I know when you put off your light. And you stayed awake longer than before. <laughs> Father, I'm fine. Nothing is wrong with me, as you can see. So you are fine? Okay. I have to leave you to enjoy your day. I said so. Thank you, Yuya. I do not know your young man, but something in me wants me to stop you from fighting Azoka. Please, I want you to tell the elders that you have changed your mind. I'm sorry, mother. I can't help it. You called me mother? Please forgive me. That's the only word I can use. 
It's all right. Please. Try and stay alive. Do not fight Azuka. No, mother. I'm on a mission from the gods to stop the people of Fumukama from terrorizing our people. We all are on a mission from the gods. And the gods will not lead us to our death. The gods will not lead me to my death, mother. It seems that you have made up your mind. Yes. All I need is your blessing. Tomorrow, you go to the elders and tell them that. Stop, Papa. I told you my mind is made up. Though I die in this battle, I would like to be written as that brave man. So, as your father, I wish you success. Thank you, Papa. May the spirits of Arusiaga, the gods of the battles, go with you. Amen, Papa. You shall be successful. You shall be victorious. Are you scared? Or are you having double mind? A mellow bee? No, I'm not. And what brings you here? To cheer you up, of course. You see, Melobi, I want you to know that even if you lose today in the fight, you have set a pace for the rest of us. Thank you very much. I'll, I'm ready to. I expected to see you here. Neither did I expect to see you, Machi. See, you're ready to go. Yes. You look more beautiful than the first time I saw you. Thank you. You look more bold mm. than the last time I saw you. Thank you. I brought you this. This is for good fortune. Please, return it back to me. I'll return it back to you. I promise. Um, <clears throat> um, Emelobi, we, we have to leave now. We don't have time. We have to leave. Uh, right? We have to leave. Yes. Okay. Oh. Oh, 
to kill a man from your kingdom before giving up the land he found it insulting for him to come by himself and witness such an uninteresting scenario so he sent me alone to accompany azuka the great beast of the night yeah. the terror of the day yeah. the lion of the jungle yeah. when he roars both man and spirit runs to their hiding. You fool, douche, to die for death. Poison needle in your neck. It will seize your blood to congeal, and you will bleed from the eyes, from the nose, mm. from the mouth, and from the air. Mm -hmm. If I do not remove it now, but I will not kill you. <laughs> I will send you on an errand to your king. Tell your king. So leave us alone and I'll spare your life. I will. 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 
Please, I want to ask you a question. I know you have heard of the young man whom the gods used to deliver us from the people of Omokama. I have heard of him. And what about him? Something strange happened before the fight. You mean the glow on his face? You are right. What does that mean? He's a good omen. A very good omen. Wise one, I do not understand your explanation. I want you to go a little bit further. If I did a new Gonobana, Bonobana, and I'm a Masena for Potowa, Manu Gobuzwe, or Chaki. The prophecy of my father, the sojourned eye of the gods, seasons ago has come to pass. The sun is set, the moon has come out, and the stars are glowing. The glowing light on his face means that he is the chosen one and the gods. The gods are with him. I must see him at once. He is the chosen one. And the gods are with him. I thank you. Bunago I thank you.
Greetings. May I please see the beautiful maiden? Who is Fire? Let me call her. How did you find me? Through this. You told me it's for good fortune. And no fortune could be greater than you. Your smile will make the gods rejoice at their creation. <laughs> Thank you. I heard about your victory over almighty Azoka. I must leave now. Okay, let me see you all. Please, what is Emelobi? Emelobi? My yes. son? Yes. It's not at all. Ah. Is there any problem? Yes, uh, I'm one who wants to sign. I hope for good. Yes. It's okay. As you can see, he's not at home. Okay. When he comes back, huh? Tell him to go and see Amuma the shrine of Igodaba. Please. He should not fail. Hmm? It's okay. He is the chosen one, the future king of Umwezala. Future king? Why is one I do not understand? How do you mean? Ne madana finyolinyoli. Manande mwana fi milimi. I am as sure as the day and night. Death after birth, that he is the chosen king. But the prophecy was uh, that out of the breast of the woman would be Christ, a king shall be born. From the days of my great grandfather, my grandfather and my father, the gods, has repeatedly said that he shall be born from the womb of the woman with the crest and he shall be the chosen king. But the melody is not her song. Hey! What is it? Hey! 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 I never knew I'm going to go to the I bless you, my king. What? Who? No. Welcome to the chosen world of Umezala. Thank you, the gods of Umezala. I bless you, the gods of Umezala. Thank you. Thank you. My eyes have behold the future king. No. The sun is shining brighter. The rain is falling. And the moon is shining. Thank you. You are blessed, my king. I bless the feet of the king. I bless the feet of the king. And I bless the gods to behold this day. How would this be possible? Are the gods trying to confuse us? The prophecy said that the woman with the crest shall bear a child. Who will become our king? 
and the only child of his young man is Akuna, my son. But Amuma has never lied to us before. Na. Na. Are you okay? My joy. Please sit. Na. We all are grateful to a melody for saving us. But you must do something about this his popularity. It's getting too much. Some villagers said he deserves to be crowned the king. Hmm. They might not be entirely wrong. What? What did I hear you say? Enai, have you forgotten your own son whom the gods predicted shall be born and to be the king of this kingdom. Have you? Hmm. You see, Oma, my joy. Let me ask you one question. Before I found you at the stream, do you have a son there? Well, I'm not here to answer any useless question from you. Listen, Nai. If you don't do something about this, about this rumor, I, Isoma, will personally handle it myself. Does it mean she has a son? We do not know. Well, that's no problem. In the fullness of time, what is hidden must be made known. Your food is ready. Don't worry. I'm not hungry. The gods have filled my stomach with the desires of my heart. Rima, is he not so handsome and strong? Yes, he is my lady. He is everything a lady desires in a man. How might he be? That made my daughter to be this happy. <laughs> oh, may the gods be praised. <laughs> I have noticed your stomach. Sing source of joy for you. Father, you are right. But I will not tell you who he is now. In due time, I will let you know. Oh, my daughter. I'll be happy. <laughs> um, remember. You can. Mother, you are here. Akuna. Mother. Where are you coming from? I went for my usual morning stroll. Where is father? Akuna. You heard the rumor going round by the villagers that Emolobi should be crowned king. Oh, that? <laughs> Mother. You just called it a rumor, and that's what it is. Do not let it disturb you. I am going to be crowned the king, and the gods said so. The gods are not the people. If you are to be the king, you will be ruling the people, not the gods. You must stop the rumor from spreading further. 
don't you know that the people have a way of influencing the gods by doing their own thing without even thinking what the gods will do or say akona me panyage me panyage fuzo mother why worry over nothing you worry yourself a lot see I am confident that I am going to be crowned the king. Not minding what the people think or say about it. The gods have chosen me. Please, mother, can we stop this conversation? I am hungry. Um, Mazio Komba, please don't be offended in what I'm going to ask you. It is for the future of the kingdom. Um, MLOP, is he your blood son? Is there any problem? You're asking if MLOP is my great blood son. Did you hear anything? Anything that... What happened? No, I did not hear anything. But please tell me. I want to know. The gods might have a bigger plan for him. He's my son. Mm. It's alright. Um, I might be wrong. And the gods might be as well. I'm sorry for bothering you. It's no problem. It's okay. I wonder if the gods were drunk when they chose Akuna as our future king. Even the maiden, the gods have predicted that to be the one to complete him. I've decided to choose Emelobi because she knows that Emelobi is the perfect man for her. I agree with you. I'm hoping that the gods will reconsider their decision and make Emelobi their own. In my own opinion, I suggest we make Emelobi our future king because he saved us from the hands of Omukama. And you know he's not proud like Akuna. He has a kind heart. Well, as for me, making him the king is not the problem. But we must all know and not forget that the gods have already chosen a king for us. Mm, we are the one that needs a king and not the gods. We can as well make the gods change their mind. How? We all know that no one has ever changed the mind of the gods. We have to seek for an audience with Amuma and convey our message to the gods and let them know we want a melody and not a kuna. Yes, yes. Yeah, right. Going around proclaiming yourself king. That is ridiculous, Akuna. How can I proclaim myself the king when the gods already announced you as our king? So I ask you, Emelobi, do you want to be king? 
No! I wouldn't want to contend with the gods. You better do not. For the gods might be merciless and cruel. Did you come here to threaten him? Did you? No. Actually, I came to see you. So if you don't mind, um, <clears throat> can we go to a private place and talk, my beautiful? Not today. As you can see, I am busy. You are busy with him! When you're supposed to be with me, you're betrothed! Stop it! I cannot stop it! I am not betrothed to you! I am only your friend. We are pairs made by the gods, Machi. We are made to be together. The people and the gods know we are destined for each other. Machi, is it true that you walked out on Akona just because of him? Father, is it not obvious that Akona is not the man promised by the gods? My heart does not beat for him. I do not feel butterflies in my stomach whenever I'm with him, just as I feel for a melobi. Hmm. Right from the very first day I set my eyes on a melobi, I knew that my chi and his chi became inseparable. My daughter, um, I know that your wisdom is a gift from the gods. And I guess you should know that you and Akona's destiny are entwined by the gods. Both of you are meant for each other. For that even the gods cannot live my life for me. They cannot. This is my fate. It is my destiny and I choose to live it the way I want to. They cannot just choose any man for me and expect me to have feelings for the man. No, 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 no. Don't speak blaspheme of the gods. They are all knowing. They know what is best for everyone they have created. Father, I know. But this is my destiny and I choose to live the way I want. I'm sorry, Father. Much. My elders, for days now, the people have been going about saying they desire a Melobi to be their king. Over a corner, the gods give them. And I believe you all must have heard of it. So I ask, why do you keep silent over this? There is nothing anybody can do about it. The desire of the people is the will of the gods. MLOB is the chosen one. Twenty-four seasons ago, your father told us that a woman with the crest will give back to a son. And that in song will finally become our king. Here is 
is the woman, and here is the son. Mm. Oh, I don't know how a uh, melody comes into picture. Right from the days of my great grandfather, my father and I, the gods has repeatedly said that the chosen king shall be born from the womb of the woman with the crest. And the melody. Shut up! Shut up, Amuma! It's obvious a melody bribed you to name him the king. But it will never happen. Never! With due respect, Isioma, how can a melody bribe me when he is. Shut up! I said, shut up! You deceitful liar! My elders, is this not obvious to you all now? I mean, clearly! Amuma here and the melody has a plan. They are in this together. No wonder that tiny melody was able to defeat Almighty Azuka so easily yes. because they have a plan. Amuma here has a plan. Elders of the land, I shall take my leave because I will no longer stand here and watch her speak blasphemy. But one thing is certain. MLOB is the chosen one. I leave. And I will not leave to make this land conducive for you, Amuma. If you don't go back and consult the gods again, because not even you or MLOB will stand in my way or stop me from becoming the king. Never! I am the chosen it one! It will not happen. Not even you can stop me. I told you to act fast and stop the room. You refused. I also warned you that that boy is out to steal your birthright. You still did not listen to me. There is still time for you to take what is yours. No, mother! No! The lizard's love for the cracked house does not make it the owner. Mother, allow me to humiliate my enemies with gentle touches. Ayamakuna. The son of Anosike, the chosen one for the throne of this kingdom. And I also want you not to forget that the fly that doesn't heed to advice follows the corpse to the grave. Do not do something that will incur the wrath of the gods. Anosike. I have always known you as a coward. Please, Biko, do not turn my son into one. Don't! Hmm? Son. Amoma is a man I know that doesn't lie or take bribe. So I want you to calm down. Let's listen to him. And know the reason for his sudden claim. Amosike, what other reason do you need? Tell me, what other reason do you need? Amoma, Nemelobi are in this together. And they must pay for trying to steal my son's birthright for him. They must pay. Wow. A restless grasshopper ends up in the gizzard of a fowl. That is the words of our forefathers. We 
all know your little plot with Amama to name you the king. But it will never happen. Never. So I'm here to give you a fair warning. Go back to Amama. Tell him that you made a mistake and you have changed your mind from becoming the king. I am sorry. But I, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't have any interest in becoming the king of this land. The gods already selected your son Akuna as a king. Shut up! You double-faced liar! You have four market days. Four market days to reverse what you have done. Else, I will make your life. Miserable. Father, what is going on? So, I'm a high priest named you the king of this kingdom before the elders in council. Why should he? Only the gods. Only the gods know his reason. You seem bothered. What's on your mind? Is it because of the constant rumor of you being chosen by the gods? I don't want it. I just want to be known as Emelobi, the healer. I don't want to get involved with the politics of the gods. It's confusing. I'm confused. I mean, the prophecy said, that the woman with the crest will bear a child that will be the king and you, Machi, will complete him as his wife. But right now, it's all confusing. It's all going different direction. Don't you see the gods are still right? I do not feel anything for Akona. It is you my heart beats for. And Amuma has proclaimed you as the one being chosen by the gods. So you see, they are still right. Yes, but they are not entirely right. You see, it's, it's not just what... Don't worry. Allow the gods to handle things their own way. Okay?
Emel abi. Emel abi. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Papa. You're welcome. Dalu. How are you, my son? I am fine. You're welcome. Yes. Uh, is Hamil will be back? No. He's supposed to be back from the farm that he went to pluck some herbs. Okay. But till now, he's not back. Okay. Which side did he go to? I think uh, he went to Ibaja Forest. Oh. Ibaja Forest. Yes, I'm sure. Okay. Okay, let me go and search for him. Please do. It's okay, yeah. please. Try. Okay, bye-bye. And you didn't see my son? Yes, Papa. I have even searched everywhere, but I could not find him. Hi! Papa, what do you think that happened to him? How did he go? 
he will no longer desire the throne, even if the gods want. Because we made sure of it. Good. Very good. Now listen. Nobody knows here about this. Am I understood? Yes, yes, ma'am. To my heart. Father, I'm sorry. I saw him at the stream unconscious. You should have left him there than bring him to this place. Father! You surprise me. How can you say such a thing? Will you be happy if someone abandoned me to die if I were in his position? Father, please. Let's just leave him for a few nights. You have only two days. Then you send him out of this place. Do you hear me? Two days. Two days. You send him out of this place. Am I love 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 Emelopi, Emelopi,
that which the God has given to you and your daughter shall attract the blessings of the gods unto you and your household. He is destined. He is the chosen king of this kingdom and must live to rule his people. <laughs> Where are you? About what the keys are What brought you to the abode of Igodaba unannounced? Abana do kwa vum mo juoko. Ase na wade abose ife na nkete. Na oburu na onwere ife na achu onwe ife na achu. Nke puta ni ife okoko bumini achu di ampa. Namse na oku uro danya. Namsi no Kubaniro, Onyasere Wurodanya. I heard a rumor that a melobi is harmed. Is it true? Yes! Manamili Malu go baruko na siya. Ama kamili amogas. Ake kia di anaro. Ama kefi si taro. Ijo agalanya di anoko. He lives. Sure, he lives. <laughs> he is an offspring of the gods, the chosen one, and nothing will happen to him. I feel his presence and I hear his heart beat. Oh my God! Can you hear his heartbeat? Yes, father, I can. Now go to his father's compound and tell his father. He's a healer. He know what to do to revive him. Okay, father, I'll do the right thing. Now I know that the gods are with you. Morning. No, mother. I saw him left early in the morning. Oh. To where? I do not know, mother. Anytime he leaves the hut this early, it's only the shrine of Igodaba that he normally goes to. Let it not be that he heard what I discussed with Nkume and then joke him. Um, <clears throat> Mother, I'm off. Do you mean that my son is still alive? Yes, but very unconscious. Hey, please take me to him. I want to see him. Okay. Excuse me.
My daughter, please help me. Give him that help. Let him drink it. Just gradually. Soft. Will he leave? My daughter, he will leave. I would like to stay close to my son. He was able to revive him. He said he will leave, but right now he needs rest. I know that he will leave, for that is the wish of the gods. Thank you so much, Father, for helping him. Oh, I should be the one thanking you for finding him. Okay, let me get you something to eat. Nine. Why did you go so early? I went to see Amuma. I hope all is well. Yes, um, all is well. Arum. You see, before you came to this land. That was before I saw you at the stream of uh, Yososo. Amuma, the high priest of this land, predicted your coming. I've heard that story countless times, but I have lost count. Why are you repeating it? It's all right, Aru, dear. But I want you to keep your ears wide open and listen to me very attentively. Amuma is the mouthpiece of the gods of this land. His words and visions are of the gods. Very important. He is the most honest priest ever served the shrine of Igodawa. I want you to know that. So please, drop this your pursuit of uh, making Akone the king of this land. The gods have chosen another person. And you and I know very well that we cannot fight the gods. What are they about Chiamba? Makuni Buruchiyoso. Mm. Yes. You know why I will not believe you or do what you ask? No, I don't know. Go mm. ahead and tell me. Because the gods do not lie. Before my family and I were attacked, the Bianocha of my kingdom predicted that I, Isioma, is destined to bear a king. And when I came into this land, 
the same prophecy was repeated that same I is your man is destined to bear a king and suddenly the gods are rejecting my son for that fool <laughs> well let me see how he's going to sit on that phone. He is still alive. Yes. He is alive. I personally hit him on the head. And no man born of a woman will survive that. Can I see what you used to hit him? We left him there. I heard he's still alive. That is not possible. Who says so? I want you to go to the place you dumped him and get me his head. No! Okay, mom, don't disappoint you. How is he now? You sure, man, you can see. He's, st he's still sleeping. By the time he wakes up, I believe he will be all right. Yes. Um, Father, welcome. Oh, my daughter. Papa, let me get you something to eat. Oh, my daughter, thank you for caring. But I would prefer taking it when I'm back from collecting the herbs. Okay? I'll keep it hot for you. Please do. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, Ichi Oma, please, don't let anybody know that he's still here. His life may still be in danger. Ichi Oma, do not worry yourself. Asu Onye Makokwa, Nachiabokwa, he's safe here. Let me be on my way. I will soon be back, okay? Ichi Oma, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go to the stream. I'm preparing food for the laborers that is working in our farm. And my mother went to the market. Eh? Chi. Okay, I should be going there. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm almost done. Eh? Just wait for me. Since we are going the same direction. Eh? Chi, be eh? fast. Eh? I'm as worried as you are. My dear, according to my mother, the first prophecy said it's Akuna that is the chosen one. Yes, but now the chief priest is saying it's a, a Melobi. So, I don't know. It's very, very confusing. Very, very confusing. And I even heard something. That, uh, what was his name? Um, a Melobi was attacked by no person. No one knows if he's still alive or that. So, please. Akune's mother. Akune's mother is very, very wicked. Mm -hmm. I'm even suspecting she has a hand in this. Baka, Chika, are you okay? Huh? I'm leaving here. Don't call me back. I'm not saying. Where is the head? Where is it? We have searched everywhere. We could not find him. That means he is still alive. Now, go and find him. Finish him up. I said, finish him up. Yes, Mr. Man. Am I understood? Yes, Mother. Now. We must disappoint you. <laughs> What is the meaning of this? 
And what is the meaning of God? Listen to me. Stay away from Akuna. Look, young lady. Stay away from Akuna. He doesn't belong to people like you. And if you don't stay away from him, we promise to cost you pains. You heard that? You won't. Last one. Unconscious, almost dead in the bush. Sorry, sorry. How long have I been here? Three days. My father will be worried. I should, I should go. Let me go. Relax, relax. He was here. He's been the one treating you. Just relax. Sorry for troubling you, Ichiko. I just want to know if you agreed with Amoma, the chief priest, that my son Akuna is no longer the chosen one. Let him alone. Is that what bothers said? No, you shouldn't be bothered. Because the gods are not the gods of confusion. They are not the gods that will say something today and tomorrow they do another. Amuma has not told us what he had with that little boy that made him change his mind after so many years. Which means you agreed with me. That Amuma was bright. But there is nothing short of that. Nothing short of that. Amuma is someone who has never collected bribe in his lifetime. Look at him following into the hand of that little boy. A brat. Eh? Oh, Diego. Ichie Okoye. Thank you for seeing the truth with me. Uh -uh. Thank you too. Okay. And I hope. You will talk to other indigenous to also see the truth. Why not? Definitely I will talk to them. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you too. For seeing the truth. Thank hmm? you too. <laughs> thank you very much too. Uh, yes. Accept this little gift from me. What? Yes. For seeing the truth. And acknowledging the truth. No. No. I didn't expect you to do this kind of thing. Eh? Truth is like pregnancy that never hides. Eh? Anyway, all yours. thank you very much. I am very grateful for this. You're welcome. I thank you so much. You're welcome. This is beautiful. Thank you very much. Eh? <laughs> Don't worry. Sorry to make you worry. It's okay, my son. It's okay. Don't worry. How are you feeling? I I'm feeling a bit weak. It's okay. You'll be okay, right? Thank you, Papa. Who attacked you? Did you see them? Yes, they are Ichiana Sike's personal guards. 
but papa why will it and Sike want to kill me so i don't think he has a hand in it Chianosika, I believe, did not do it. He's one of the honorable men we have in this community. Very respectable. That is wife. It's Yoma. And Akuna, the son, they are something else. <clears throat> they might be seeing you as an obstacle to Akuna achieving his ambition of becoming the king of this community. So, they will have no option that to remove you from their way. Yes, but, but I I never wanted to be the king. Of course, I know. Akuna is the promised king. So why are they dragging me into it? Hmm. I believe they never had a thought of it that way. Their thinking is negative. It's okay, sir. It's your one. As a matter of fact, I am so happy. I thank you so much for your great help to my son. <laughs> my family will never, never forget the deeds you have done. We will always be grateful to you and the household. Thank you very much. It's all right, teacher. It's all, it's, it's all right. I only did my part uh, in the will of the gods. And the future of our king. Please, uh, teacher. Stop referring to me as the future king. I'm not. Akuna is, is, is the promised king. Uh, that was my first belief. But I was here many years ago. When the prophecy was made by Amuma, the high priest. Uh, only the gods can tell why they chose you in place of Akona. That is rumor. It's, these are all rumors being peddled around by people. No, 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 no. My son, it's not a rumor. Amuma, the high priest, publicly named you the king. Although you created confusion and divisions among the elders, which I'm among those that did not support his claim on you. But uh, when my daughter, Machi, brought to you, the gods appeared to me. They told me to take care of the future king. Of Umezala Kingdom. Um, uh, in all, I have to express my gratitude. I'm so happy. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. The gods will pay you. Oh, also to your family. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you, my son. My regards to Machi. First, he took away my popularity. And then, he started laying claim on my birthright. And now, the only woman I love, he wants to take her. He wants to take her away from me. I'm a lobby, why? I'm a lobby, why? Son, what is the problem? Mother, why is Emelobi always on my way? Why? Emelobi, always on your way? Did you see him today? Yes. I saw him. I saw him and his father. I know what to do. Yes. I know what to do. Mother. My mom. Come here. What is wrong with him? He's not happy because Melobi has taken a match away from him. Why 
Then you will still meddle with everything that has to do with my son. <laughs> hey, if we are not talking about God, fool. Papa, what's up? I want to go and see Amuma. I want to tell him I don't want to be the king. Mm. Well, that's the right thing to do, okay? Oh! Oh! How are you? Yeah, you scared me. I thought I'm not going to see you again. I'm very sorry. Oh. I I'm sorry I caused you to worry. I promise you I'll be more careful. Promise? I promise. Okay. 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 Um, let me run up to see Amuma. Okay. I want you to please take care of my father till I come back. I will. All right. Okay. Thank um, you. Please make sure you come back on time. I will. All, All right. right. Take care. Thank I'll you. Right. Papa, I'm coming. Okay. <laughs> Papa. You're welcome. You're welcome. welcome. Okay. Please. Nice. Sit down. Oh, Papa, I'm fine. Thank you, Papa. Thank you. Welcome, chosen one of the gods. Wise one. I know you don't want to be king. But that is your destiny. No. I don't want this destiny. I don't want to be the king. Everybody already know. Dracuna was chosen by the gods. He is their king. Please, let them have him as their king. Amelobi, this is not a matter of what you want or what you do not want. The gods create human and give them destinies the way it pleases them. You are destined from birth to be the next king of this kingdom. And there is nothing anyone can do about it. Prepare your mind. Prepare your mind to sit on the throne of this kingdom and rule your people. What? Centuries and seasons are gone. My great grandfather, my grandfather and father waited for your arrival. Oh, I am blessed. I am blessed by the gods to be here and witness the arrival of the king. Your majesty, the throne awaits you. your one and your beautiful daughter whose beauty shine like a full moon greetings to you Akuna. your mouth is full of flattering words <laughs> i am not flattering you it's your one but you see <clears throat> your daughter machi is a rare beauty that has captivated my heart <laughs> and i have come with these few gifts to pay homage to her. Yes. That is very generous. That is very generous of you. Yes. Oh. Um, don't worry. You have to take it easy with her. And I will, I will groom her into accepting your affection. Um, <clears throat> it's all right, Uchiyongwa. Um, but you better act fast. Because as you know, I will soon ascend the throne. <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> I will take my leave now. All right. Alright. <laughs> Father, why would you accept the gifts from that arrogant man? Relax. Eat. I'll tell you why. 
Greetings to you, my future king. Oh, greetings, maiden of our land. My future king, I wish to invite you to my house. Come and have a feast with me later. Oh, <coughs> I would have loved to come, but I'm busy. Uh, my future king, you can come some other time. I want to show you that I can be a great queen to you. Oh, <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. I've made my choice already. I mean, I've chosen a woman to spend the rest of my life with. You might want to choose someone in the future. I want to be that woman. Please stop! I don't want to ever have this discussion with you again. I'm sorry. Out of my sight. You see, my daughter, Akunya was the first chosen to be the king. Only the gods know why they changed him to Emenobi. And Akunya's mother, Isioma, I know her very well. She will never rest until her son becomes the king. It still does not explain why you should accept his gifts. I, I was coming there. Look, I know you love Emenobi. But Akonia loves you. But I want you to play with the two. Yes, whoever ends up in becoming the king, they will be the queen. And I know very well that Akonia will win Emenobi because he has power. Father, I don't love him. I don't. You don't need to love him. The most important thing for him is to love you. Uh, uh, before you know it, you become the queen. Yes. Mama, did you want to be one to be queen, Merobi? Da 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 da. Greetings, Machi. Hey, greetings, Merobi. How are you now? I'm better now. All thanks to you. You're welcome. Um, is your father here? No, he went out. Okay. If you're going to the stream, if you don't mind, may I keep your company? Okay, let's go. Oh, no, go get my own pot. I, I can't go empty handed. You don't need the water pot, Melobi. Let's go. No, no, no. No. Mama, <laughs> no. Maybe you go empty handed. Let me go. Makanetu was in a tea of watching a meze. The robber, Kili Kili, and I talk with you. Ma, the robber, Kili Kili, and I talk with you. Ma, the Kind of what? Nothing, my son, nothing. Hey! <laughs> Thank you for making my son to work. <laughs> Actually, he asked for it. What? I'm telling you, father. No, no, no. My son, Emelobi, asked to help a maiden. Yes, he did. Oh, God's of our land. I thank you. My son has become a man indeed. Your father is humorous! Um, Dubai. We all know that in few market days, Akuna will be 27 years. So we should make preparations to crown him king. As in Kenya, Mari Wana. Now what? Are we going to crown him king and neglect the words of our mother? Akunia is my son, yes. And I want him to become our king. 
But are we going to incur the wrath of God? Are we going to incur the wrath of the gods by doing that? What do you suggest that we should do? I ask. We have waited the long enough. That's a very good question. We should listen to the words of Amuma and crown Emelobi the king of our kingdom. That will never happen. It will never happen. Listen. We all know our king. And we must crown him king. By incurring the wrath of the gods or going against the will of the gods? Um, Ichi Anosike, what has come over you? What have you taken from that boy, Amoma? Or what has he promised you that made you go seriously against your own son? It's all right. I don't blame you. Because if it were all well up in the trees, the hawk wouldn't have come down to look for the chicken. Yes, I blame the gods who kept us in this condition and allow you to accuse me wrongly. I blame the gods, not you. You should know that I am a man that fears and respects the gods of this land. All the elders have agreed to crown your son, Akuna, the king. Mm -hmm. But your husband, Anosike, has blindly refused your son being the king. And as you know, we cannot grant him king until we get his full support. Because he is a kingmaker. Wait, Ichi Okoye. I'm listening. Are you telling me that my husband, hmm. without my husband Anosike, Akuma, my son, cannot be crowned? That, exactly. He cannot. Mm. Mm. Then. You make a new king maker. Mbano. Mbano. <laughs> it is not done that way. Eh? We cannot make a new king maker until the present one dies or rejected by the gods. <laughs> yes. Are you fighting your son and supporting a stranger? Why? Arum, don't take it that way. Our son Akonna is not the promised king. Huh? Why, why, why do you want to fight the gods? The elders have all agreed to crown him, and that is what is going to happen! Mitoria, Mitoria! <laughs> That is what is going to happen, Majoria, Majoria. How do you think he can be crowned king without Anosike? An Arab is a Kaburium. Huh? Anosike? You don't get it! You are no longer the king with Anosike! Get! And she's still shouting. Hmm. You see, Oma? When a woman moves ahead of his husband, she spots spirit. <laughs> <laughs>